smart. Who's smart? S-M-R-T. Casey, are you smart? I mean, S M A R T. That's how my head feels right now. Oh, fogs. Hi, Carrie. How are you? You enjoyed that juice? Can finally eat chicken again. Yes. Mmm. Please take a picture. Guess who had only stalled twice? Wait. Friend, I'm glad that your driving lesson went well. I don't really know what's happening in stream right now. I'm just vibing. I'm just here trying to paint my son. And trying not to have people yell at me. Now to figure out how to convince my boss it's legit. We need like an email out address or something, Alan. We need to create like a a doctor's email address for you or some shit. I feel like I need more pink and shit in this area. This is like not the level of blended I want. I don't know how to make this look nice. Help. Set set send help. I have picked up too much pink. Help. You know, I don't know what to do. This area looks too, like, light. You did put an email address. I am apparently the Pope. <laughs> You didn't cry today. Good. I'm glad you didn't cry. I don't know what starter to pick. Ooh, a fire one, probably. Your blending skills are epic. Oh, well, thank you. I didn't think that they were. I'm having a hard time blending uh, the colors over here. And, like, my trick is to use white. Like, that's literally what an instructor once told me, was to use white paint. And that's been helping a lot with the blending. But I keep getting into this weird area where, like, it's a little too much white. Though I don't really want to use any more orange. And I don't really want to use yellow. Like, I feel like I just need to mix a little bit of a lighter pink. Quack. quack. Who quacked at me? Harry Quack. Here we go now. Okay, so maybe having this pink here. And then taking a little bit of orange in with it. I think that's more the color I'm looking, actually. More the color I was looking for. You don't love orange, but... Jesus fuck, what the fuck was that? Somebody just cheered something. Casey, thank you for the 69 biddies. Oh my god. Sorry, friends. Bear with me. I'll catch up with y'all in a sec. I just have to be very careful and quick with how I blend this stuff.
because I don't want the lines to dry before I have a chance to I mean, we're getting there. The sun. It's like around here. Make it a little bit darker. So I want the center of the sun to almost look white. There. I think that looks pretty okay. What do you guys think? I'll show you the right side away. I'm gonna DM you a question about stream to rush to look right now. Okay, sounds good, Hannah. Thank you. It looks so pretty. I love the colors. Thank you. Y'all are so sweet. Y'all are far too kind. Um, I'll flip this the right way around, though. So you guys can get a little bit of a better idea. Of kind of what's happening. I feel like it doesn't look as nice on stream as it does in person. Like, it definitely looks better in real life at this point. Oh, did you send boba too? Okay, I'll go ahead and have a look. What flavor did you get? Uh, kiwi fruit with cherry popping boba. Wait, that sounds good. Lee probably also wants boba now. Uh, I hate that boba places here don't app open until the afternoon. I want boba in the morning, like for breakfast. <laughs> My boss just texted me five minutes before needing I needed to leave, asking if I was going to be there in 30 minutes. So I got panic ready for work. Wait, that's so annoying. It's like, um, yeah, I'm going to come in when I'm supposed to be there. Maybe you have to throw a fet. Oh, no. Can I get a shaman now? I don't know. Can you? Can you? Uh, here, I think I can open Discord. Where? 
Uh, wait, where am I looking? Um, Hannah, your question is answered in the mod section of Discord. If you want to have a look in there, your answer is already there, love. Um, Carrie's tea. Wait, that looks really good. It's so green. Yeah, I wasn't expecting it to be so, so green. Nearest boba place to me, nine to two. And they're, but they're far. Okay, that's fair. That's fair. Thought someone called out and no one told me. So now I'm ready and I don't have to be there. Wait, do you not have to be there at all, Cross? Is that why? Okay, so we are going to need... We're going to need black. And I think I'm just going to do a black hill along the bottom here and then a tree. I think that'll be fine. Uh, Wonderstar, hello, how are you? Welcome on in, my friend. I hope you're having a wonderful day. Happy Monday. I hope you had a good weekend. You finally have the request. Yes. Oh, that's okay, Hannah. Don't worry. No stress, love. No stress. I just wanted to make sure I actually, like, answered your question. You know what I mean? Um, You're good. I'm glad you're doing okay, Wonderstar. Uh, missing request was switching my OCD. Oh, no. Happy little tree. I mean, just a little happy accident, Fari. Um, let me see. I have black somewhere. So just give me a sec, friend. I thought I had a big tube of black, but I think my big tube of black is actually chalkboard paint. So hopefully we have enough in here. I mean, I don't see why we wouldn't. It's not going to be too much. Back to the <laughs> to my new old game. Oh my god. It's been very relaxing. That's good, Wonderstar. I hope you did some stuff that's like some good self-care. Uh, still have to be in at 10. Oh, yeah, there's a bunch of stuff I added for you to do. Pisses me off. No, for sure, Cross. Because that's not very professional, too. You know what I mean? It's like, obviously, she's, uh... She looks like, she seems like she's rushing things too, you know what I mean? And has just like a poorly planned day, which is super frustrating for you. Okay, so we're going to do black all along the bottom here. I am eventually going to have to paint the edges of the canvas, but I might do like orange on this side, blue up here, and blue over here. And now I'm super anxious because you had to rush to get ready. Exactly. And, like, that's going to throw you off for the rest of the day now. You know what I mean? I hate when that happens, when you feel like you have to get rushed to get ready. And then it turns out you didn't really have to, you know? Walkthrough or no walkthrough? Ooh, I don't know, Masala. I always like to try stuff without a, without a walkthrough first. But I don't know if that's just me. Okay, so the bottom bottom of this will definitely be black. So I'm just going to be a little bit heavier handed with this just so we get a decent coat. I might actually have to wait for the black to dry and come back and do another coat after, but that's okay. Try and do it without the walkthrough first then, Ms. Olive. That's the way that you normally like doing it. Like, why should this quest be any different than the others, you know? Did Alexing, called my doctor in the pharmacy. Now I can continue dying in peace. So wait, Bex, do you not have, like, allergy medication that you can take to kind of ease ease some of your side of, or not side effects ease some of your symptoms today what's everyone been up to honestly nothing much dave and i played a decent amount of kirby this weekend um so now we're kind of caught up with where i am on stream which is really fun um we cleaned a little bit we did some laundry um i planned some content for the next few months 
just some posts and things like that that I want to get done. Uh, what else did we do? I went to go get my free stuff at the weed shop at the end of our street. Turns out that the manager, like, low-key rigged, rigged a contest for me, so that was kind of fun. Um, what else? Oh, I finished our grocery list, so hopefully we can order our groceries and we'll have some good stuff in the house this week. Ended up finding, like, a lot of good vegetarian options, which is really nice. So we'll have a decent amount of veggie veggie options for us this week, which I'm really excited. Uh, what else did we do? Um, I think that's it. I think that's it. I didn't really do too much else this weekend. I just kind of hung out in people's streams and kind of relaxed. Like I like to take at least one day of the weekend kind of like not completely off from Twitch, but like pretty off from Twitch so like I'll lurk in streams but I'm not going to be super chatty so like I was lurking in a few people's streams on Saturday Saturday is normally the day where I'm very like MIA from Twitch stuff if that makes sense um yeah that's what I've been up to what's everybody else been up to see I really want to fix the lines on this I don't like that I ordered the Yoda ears. So I think if I can try and get all of the stuff for the baby Grogu cosplay, then I think we'll do it next week. Um, I do need to finish like ordering stuff for it though, because I need um, green face paint. And I need to figure out what I'm going to wear as like a robe for that, because I'm not entirely sure. Um, I do obviously still have to like make sure the ears are flattened out and stuff because like they curve a lot forward but yeah that's what i've been up to what's everybody else been up to oh it's your asthma oh god i'm sorry bex i hope you're okay love working on making a new cleaning cleaning calendar so fun stuff wait carrie that or fari that actually sounds kind of fun though like do you add the kids to that list or is this more just for you um hi lamp how are you the stars on your backdrop are super cute and i'm loving the painting so far thank you so much my friend um the stars back here are actually um it, it, you can't really tell right now but if i'm like pretty zoomed in like hold on if i if i do this um you can see the names in the background so these are all the donors that we've had for our fundraiser so far um so i have everybody's name up on our wall um, but thank you. I hope you're doing well, Lamp. Welcome on in. Um, Masala, who did you choose for your starter? Cleaning calendar? I never thought of that. The fire bunny. Wait, that sounds fun. Tosh, hello, Tosh. Happy Monday. How are you? How are you? For almost a year. Now it seems to be getting there. That's good, at least. Am I the only one who doesn't give nicknames to their Pokemon? No, I don't normally either. Uh, the only time I did was for Brilliant Diamond. I love you, Casey. So we clean every other weekend. We do like a big cleaning of the house. My aunt is a she. Wait, what? Did you say he? <laughs> um, I'm here but lurky. Love you, Casey. Hold on, I saw a robe somewhere. I never learned their names properly. I love that. Just inhale the hydro flask full of black currant squash. Now you're gonna have to pee. You need water. You need water, my friend. Mostly for me, but I'll assign them jobs on it that need to get done. Yes, we're at $804. So we're almost at $805, which means we need $195 till we hit our goal of a thousand which means i'll get a pie to the face i'm nervous <laughs> bought a load of harry potter trading cards wait that sounds awesome that sounds super awesome you enjoy the graphics i might need you to share this calendar it sounds adh friendly for our brains for real for real d i love you enjoy your lurky my friend much much love I also need this cleaning calendar. See, we just clean every other week. That's basically as good as it gets with us. 
My bagels don't have holes. I feel conflicted. Were they just like overbaked? Like, are they super poofy? Also, if I've missed any messages, uh, please feel free to repost because I don't, I can't keep track today. I don't know what I missed and what I didn't. I'm having one of those days where I feel like I've responded to something, but I definitely haven't. Or I think that I haven't, but I definitely have. So yeah, if I've missed your message, feel free to repost. Google uh, cleaning calendars. There's so many. So hold on, uh, Fari, do you just kind of add it to your like regular calendar? I don't know. We're pretty good about keeping track of that kind of stuff. It's like we can see when the dishes need to be done. We know we vacuumed last week, so we're not vacuuming this week. I don't know. I feel like a cleaning calendar would actually stress me out. Because then I would feel like I'm not getting stuff done. Does that make sense? Like, I feel like that'd stress me out more. Um, but if I wait to clean on the weekends, I feel like everything piles up and then I don't want to do it. Having a schedule will help. No, that's fair, Leave. That's fair. I'm just saying, like, that's what works for us, right? Like for me, I have a really hard time with focusing on cleaning during the week. Um, and part of that is because I feel like that time could be used towards doing like content creation stuff. So I don't know. I always run this like weird, like I feel like I should be doing something else kind of a kind of a vibe. Um, Leave, thank you for popping up uh, the extra extra like donation link. And Bex, there you go, friend. Um, one side definitely shows excuse me, it should have a hole, then inside and top are closed up. It feels like they just, um, it feels like they spread too much. Uh, I'm gonna eat and then go to my niece's birthday. Have fun, Masala. Enjoy your food, my love. Um, but yeah, it sounds like your bagel's just, like, overproofed almost. You're making a spreadsheet. Okay, okay, okay. A spreadsheet checklist. That's actually not a bad way to go about it, I think. Do laundry when it's necessary. <laughs> Having kids the messiest dog ever. It helps to keep the whole family on the same page. That's really smart. That's really smart, Fari. Back in the day, I used a physical planner. Do people still do that? The reason I stopped is because I would forget it places. Um, I definitely still use a physical planner. In fact, I was doing all of my content planning in here yesterday. Um, I used to have like an like I have an agenda agenda. But I don't like using it anymore. Like, it's not, like, Bujo, Bujo quality. But, like, I, I do have a book that I use. I really like physical books, physical notebooks. I like pens. I like pencils. I like being able to write. Um, but I know a lot of people are kind of moving towards um, digital planners and stuff like that. Love spreadsheets. Love you, Masala. Laptop's gonna die. Sounds good, Carrie. No worries, love. Go and charge your laptop. But yeah, Lamp, I don't know. How are you feeling with a physical lap uh, planner right now? Physical laptop, my god. Still use a planner too. Keeps appointments and such straight. Yeah. I feel like I couldn't do... I feel like I couldn't do just digital stuff. Because I would forget to check it. Like, I'm the type of person who remembers things a lot better if I've written something by hand. I always have been, even for university and like high school and studying and stuff like that. I always needed to study by hand and write my notes by hand because or else I wouldn't remember stuff. So I find that I remember a lot better and I can think a lot more clearly if something is like physically written. I don't know if that makes any sense. I know Casey's a big fan of digital planners, though. Um, in the before times, my work mom figured out if I showed up in a dress, it's because I ran out of clean pants. No, wait, really? Oh, that's hilarious. I'm sure a lot of people are like that, though. I let my laundry go far too long. Uh, without doing it the past like couple of weeks 
Um, so I did all of my laundry yesterday and I was like, yes, I have all new clean everything for the rest of the week. I'm so happy. It's like I went to sleep in one of my pants the other day, like in uh, a pair of not leggings, but like comfy sweatpants. And in the middle of the night, Dave was like, babe, you went to sleep in your clothes. And because he knows I never do that. Like, I'm a big fan of pajamas. And in the middle of the night, I rolled over and I sassed him out. And I was like, well, if I had had time to do my laundry when you were doing yours, then I would have had clean pajama pants. <laughs> but I literally was like, I have nothing. I have nothing clean. And I don't feel like wearing disgusting, dirty pajama pants. And then I felt bad because in the morning I woke up and I actually found a clean pair of pajama pants. And I was like, well, I guess I could have worn something to cle clean to sleep last night, but it's fine. Sorry, I'm just trying to sharpen up the edges on this so that there's not just like black little dots. <laughs> um... Mostly use mine for to-do to -do lists. Yes. Uh, I keep actual appointments online. That's fair leave. Because then at least you can have like an alert or something. An alarm go off, you know. Just bought a notebook because I want to start journaling. Ooh, Hannah, what kind of notebook did you get? I need them online so I can get reminders constantly. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. Like it depends if you need a reminder for something or not, right? Like if I have something that I absolutely need to remember that I need to go and do... And like, I know I'm going to forget otherwise, then I will set, I'll just set an alarm in my phone. Like I won't even set an event or anything. I literally will just set an alarm and I'll title it whatever I need to remember. Because that's just how my brain works. Okay. So I think that's looking pretty crisp. So I think at this point we might, as soon as this little section here is dry, I'll be able to move on to the tree. Now I'm a little bit nervous about this tree because I don't know how big or how thick or how tall I should make it. Uh, don't use an app for my planner calendar. I need a book, paper, pen, yes. I don't always trust electronics. That's fair, love. That's fair. I feel like I forget easier if I don't write it down. I use an app called uh, Tick Tick for organizing, planning, and lists. It's so good, I pay for the premium version. Is that like an iPhone app or is it on Android as well? Tick Tick. So that's cool. So it organizing, planning, and lists. I might need to look into that. You use an app on your phone for reminders. That's fair. See, I think like something that you need like a constant push notification for, it needs to be on your phone. But if it's something you just need to like brain out on a piece of paper, then I feel like it's fine to do it on a piece of paper. I don't know. Use my phone alarm to remember things all the time. Yep, literally just the alarm. Not even an event, nothing, just the alarm. <laughs> But you need basic at first. No, that's fair, Hannah. That's fair. Did you get it lined or is it actually like a bullet journal? Okay, so I'm going to paint the sides of the canvas while we're waiting for the black to dry over here. So I think I'm going to go with like an orangey, like a pale orange, orangey pink over here. So I'm just going to mix that color up quickly. Pale orangey pink. Hopefully that's enough. I hate leaving the sides of the canvas blank. There, I think that's fine. And then we'll mix up a bluey purple for the other two areas. I need to go change my water, but we're going to be using a lot of black soon, so I shouldn't worry. Uh, every so often I try and use a journal or calendar. It lasts about three days. Oh my god. Like, I can show you guys. I, I used to plan everything 
I used to plan everything in here. So like, this is what my like scheduling stuff used to look like. So I used to, I used to plan like that. And then, I don't know, I did more like sturdy looking ones. Um, then I used my other planner. I have just like basic to-do lists in here. Um, like I said, this is the stuff I was working on yesterday for like future content stuff. Um, yeah, I used to use this journal for a lot of that stuff too. And then I just fell out with it. So I think now me doing my like schedules on Canva is really helpful. And that's kind of where I just brain everything out. Tick Tick is on Android. Yes. A uh, tiny bit of a learning curve, but from there it's smooth sailing. I'm going to have to check that out. I like the idea. I like the idea of that. I'm going to take my Grogu ears off for a bit, guys. So let's mix this a color to do the sides of this canvas. That's what we we're doing, right? Like a purpley blue. It's lined. Okay. Use an app to remind me to take my medication. That's smart. That That is definitely smart. Because I feel like especially if it's medicine that you need to be taking every day. It's important to make sure you have a good like steady way to do that. Okay, so let's grab white. Blue. A bit of purple. This should be a decent color to go and paint the edges with. Good enough for me. And again, I'm just trying to give the black some time to dry. I also want to be really careful not to get this on the front of the canvas because it definitely doesn't match any of the colors we're doing right now. just have one one edge left to paint I don't know if you guys can even see that but I don't know if I have enough paint left for this though shit I don't think I, I don't think I saved myself enough paint that's fine there we go. All good. All good in the hood. All right, cool. Now, is this dry? Can I paint a tree on here? I think I can. I think I can. I think I can. I think I can. Oh, if I don't take them, I'm an anxious mess and you get headaches. See, I wouldn't want to deal with the headache. The anxiety, obviously, you don't want to deal with. But like, oh, headaches. Headaches just do me in. So I don't blame you, friend. It's always better to, like, be on top of that shit, you know? I remember to take my medications when about five hours. <laughs> Too late, I get nauseous. Oh, no. Probably a better system out there. Definitely. De definitely, yes. There's definitely a better way to do it, friend. Uh, almost wrote an email as, Hi, boob, instead of Bob. Oh, no. Leave. Oh, no. <laughs> All right, let's uh, nervously get started with this tree. Cause I'm, I'm very nervous. I'm very nervous about this tree. My tree is what ruined, I think my last painting I did. Like, oh, <laughs> All right, cool. We did not get black paint everywhere. I thought I did. How tall do I need to make this tree? 
You can do it, Otto. You can do it, Otto. Help each other out. That'll be our motto. Thank you, Bugs. You can do it, Otto. You, you can, can do, do it, Otto. Otto. I don't really know what type of tree I want to do either, so like that's the other thing. I guess I should decide. I should probably I should probably decide what kind of tree I'm gonna do. This tree is crooked. <laughs> love journaling I've been doing it since I was in first grade something just uh told me that once I grew up I'd be happy I did it and I am um have you been like super consistent with it lamp like since you were little or like do you fall out with it here and there because I think it's really really cool to have that to look back on um and see like what has happened in your life over the years now I say that however I give myself like first-hand embarrassment that way because I literally will just be like embarrassed by what I wrote as a kid um I may need to go and see the painting that I've done in the past for reference on how to do this how to do this tree would you guys like to see a painting that I've done before it's not great but I can go and get it because I think I kind of need it as a reference for a sec At least for the branches. Yeah, I'm gonna grab it. Give me a second. As a history person, I think everyone should journal in some in some way, but I fail at that. Uh, so that in a thousand years, historians can figure out <laughs> what the fuck we were doing. Honestly, leave. That is the one reason I love the idea of journaling because let's say all digital shit falls to shit at some point. Like, there's gonna be no record of anything you know what i mean so like having physical copies of stuff is gonna be like one of the only way um is gonna be like one of the only ways oh good i'm glad casey i had no one uh, to confide in when i when growing up so i really needed an outlet now that i'm older and have loving friends i don't journal daily but i never stop for too long i love that lamp that's awesome I love that. I think it's really nice to be able to like go back and see and also just to have that place to always be able to say things that you want to and like talk about things that you want to. You know what I mean? Um, people vlog and stuff, but what if YouTube dies? Exactly. Exactly. Leave. Uh, Morgan. Hello, my love. How are you? Happy Monday. This is the painting we're currently working on. Uh, it's what we drew out of the hat today. Um, I'm just gonna go grab one of my older paintings just to look at for a sec, guys, because I'm having a hard time seeing how I want to do the swing. I'm not going to show you guys the painting because it's super dusty, but I think I have an idea now. I think I have an idea now. Um, I like the idea that the information age will just be a huge uh, blank patch for future, future archaeologists. It's true. It's true. It's literally going to be a blank spot. Oh, wait, what? You were crying over Luna howling? Wait, she's never howled before? I cussed so many people out in my journal. That shit's hilarious. Looking back on it. Oh my God, I love. <laughs> uh, is it a sunset? Yes, it looks awesome so far. I'm okay. How are you? I'm doing pretty okay, friend. I'm doing pretty okay. I'm feeling very like chilled out and like very relaxed today. And I think that's like such a fun way to start the week is just by doing something super chill. So I'm glad we chose painting for today. Um, I am going to figure out how to do some sort of tree action. <laughs> Um, with this tree over here. So we'll see. We'll see how it goes. My old journals were like, I like this boy. JK, I like this boy more. 
my journal is so depressing i could never reread it morgan i give myself embarrassment with it like i definitely can't go back and like read things it, it like it bothers me it genuinely bothers me so i get that stood at the stairs and howled what a little drama queen what a little drama queen okay Ooh. so we're gonna add branches and the first branch that i want to add actually i lied i'm gonna take the tree up a little a little taller the fur oh! no how do i fix it guys how do i fix it can i turn that into a branch can can i turn that into a branch fuck all right well i'm gonna ignore that for a second so i wanted our first like branch to kind of be here man Maybe it can just be a branch. I don't know. Yeah, it's fine. I'll try and turn it into a branch. It's not... Not exactly what I wanted. Not exactly how thick I wanted the branches to be, but... I think it's better than trying to cover it up. Happy little accident, everybody. Let me know if you think I should just try and cover it up. That's going to be our branch for the swing. Goddamn, guys. I'm really annoyed that that happened. <laughs> <sighs> Mine were also depressing. I've only looked through once and I was like, okay, cool. Never looking at that again. Yeah, right? Oh my god. I had my journal from the day Emmy told me she loved me. Wait, I love that. Kim, hi Kim, how are you? Uh, let it dry in white paint. That's what I was thinking. I was thinking of doing white on top with some blue. Because, like, does that just look really fucked now? Or can we get away with it? Should I cover this branch? I can probably cover it because I did that to another canvas we messed up the other day. Happy little accident. Is the branch okay or does it look awful? I'm so glad I wasn't able to record all my teen idiocy. So embarrassed, much cringe. That is exactly how I feel. So embarrassed, much cringe. happy little accident oh god i never kept a journal but if i did when i was younger um it would have had how much i love johnny depp wait i love that also same <coughs> haven't really kept one since middle school where i filled up two jesus keep it uh makes a funny story thought when we look at it because we know the secret behind the branch okay you think it looks fine okay i am gonna maybe try and add leaves to the tree i don't know we'll see so the tree i had done in the painting that i went to go look at was like an, an imaginary type of tree like it was like had really curly branches and it looked like something magical so i didn't that wasn't really the vibe i was going for today so i can't really use that trick unfortunately But I can maybe try. Hmm. See, this doesn't look like the type of tree that would have like a branch with a uh, swing though.
I wish the paint was like a little bit more smooth too. I feel like she's very chunky. Chin, that branch looks so fucked. <laughs> uh, Yasmin, hello, Yasmin. Happy Monday. How are you, my love? Had journals when I was younger. Haven't written one since 2015. That's interesting. Do you miss journaling, Kim? We were actually talking about journaling a little bit today. And I feel like I miss it. I feel like I miss it. Okay, so friends, question. Do we try and add leaves to the tree or do we leave it as like a naked winter sad tree? Um, I'm going to try my best to paint the swing. Uh, I have no smaller brushes, so this is just going to, it's just going to be a situation of it is what it is. My other tree is so much nicer. <laughs> Super sleepy. Work is going well, though. Oh, are you working right now? I'm glad it's going okay. When in doubt, leaf it out. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. But I don't know if adding leaves is going to ruin it, you know? That is my swing, because that is all I'm literally capable of doing. Leaves or no leaves, guys. I think my phone replaced my journal, plus therapy. I hate how much I'm on my phone. I mean, phones can definitely be a good source and, like, a good place to journal, too, though. You know what I mean? Or just, like, to write some feelings and thoughts and stuff down. Like, even if it's not a journal app or something like you could use your notes the same way you know what i mean okay friends what do we think leaves or no leaves i don't know how i would do the leaves if i would just do them in black and try and do like really thin lines or if i should get green and like actually try and paint like pine needles maybe what do, what do we think? Work is really happy with how I'm doing. That's good. I'm so glad, Yasmin. Um, I'm in for just over an hour still. Might be getting some good news. Ooh. Lives? You choose lives. Trying to be on my phone less. That's fair, Hannah. I definitely am trying to be more intentional with my phone use. Like, I'll definitely, like, leave it like in the other room for a while and stuff like even yesterday i did the same thing i was like i'm gonna leave my phone over here and i'm just gonna like be away from it for a little bit um that'll be hard to do once i have a new phone but <laughs> um the swing looks so bad black would be cool fits the foreground silhouette yeah that's what i think too So maybe I will show you guys the other painting. Give me a sec. Just as long as you promise not to judge. Because this is the this is the idea. I'm just gonna get it. It's really dusty, just so you're, you know. Okay, so this is the other painting that I keep talking about that I did something decently similar. So it's super dusty, so you're not gonna be able to see all the details and stuff. Um, but it was supposed to be like a reflection into the water. Um, so this bottom part is water. So this is what I meant by it wasn't like a real tree. Like I did very curly, curly things and then made like little imprints for the leaves. So do you think we should do like the same kind of imprinty thing for the leaves? Because I think that would be really cool. 
Also, again, I'm sorry, it's super dusty. But what do you what do you guys think? Hopefully you can see. So like the same kind of splotchy thing, or should we just not? Because I feel like I'm gonna ruin it. I feel I feel like I'm gonna ruin it. I'll be right back. I'm gonna go put this back. Yeah, that was the painting that I've been referencing all day. Thank you. Notepad in my phone is great creative journal for recording and fleshing out ideas. Yes. Always tried to carry a physical idea journal. It was annoying to carry. <laughs> Anytime I had a good idea, I didn't have it with me. I get that. That's this notebook for me. This this goes with me everywhere. Plum, hello, I love you. It's okay if you're not feeling chatty. Is it pretty? Yeah? Okay. Quick memos for work ideas. I like it. And if it's not how you want, you can always paint over it. That's true. So you're saying to try the leaves, yeah? I feel like I'm really nervous. I feel like I'm really nervous to do that. I feel like I'm really nervous to do that. Hmm. Maybe we could practice. Maybe we could practice. So I'm thinking just like a stippling action would probably be good for this, right? So just making sure I don't have enough. I don't have too much. Can we do something like that? Like along the along the branches? That actually might work. Fuck it, let's go for it. What's the worst case, right? Worst case, I fuck it up. We cover it. Right? So I'll do dabs here first. So there's a hair. Let's, uh... I mean, I think it's gonna look okay. Don't be nervous. At the end of the day, no matter what happens, it's all good. Doesn't need to be perfect. It'll be awesome no matter what you do. Thank you so much, Kyla. Excited to eventually try out the fan paintbrush. Ooh. I hope it's awesome. I've never used a fan paint uh, paintbrush before, but they look like a lot of fun. Okay, so this is actually not horrendous. I didn't think it was going to be... What do we think of that, friends? Oh shit, that actually worked out decently! Wait! Even our little happy accident br uh, branch doesn't look terrible. I like it. <laughs> I'm actually, I'm actually pretty impressed. Not gonna lie. 
Random collection of work nodes. Minecraft coordinates, that's a heckin' mood. I used to just screenshot that. You can just laugh and try again or cover it up. It's true. Leave it as a memory. Got a fan brush to try out painting like how Bob Ross does his trees. Yes. Need to check if my paints are still good. Please do. Please do. I saw some fan brushes and like some kits with sponges and stuff and it was very like Bob Rossy to me. Um, it looks good. Thank you, friends. Do you like it? I can hold it up for you guys too. Sorry, I just saw that Casey asked that. Gotta go uh, speak to you later. Much love, Wonderstar. Much love, darling. I hope you have a wonderful day. I don't know if you guys can really... Can really see it, but... What do we think? Is there anything else I should add? Anything else I should add? Anything that you think needs to be changed? I hope Bex likes it. I should probably sign and date it too, because I didn't do that. I did not sign and date it. Let me just rinse this paint first. So what should we do for the next painting, friends? Maybe some birds in the sky? Ooh, maybe we could. Just add like a couple. I don't know, I kind of want to leave it. Like maybe a couple birds right here would be nice actually. Let me add a little white to this because I just want to clean that up a little bit. Maybe some birds in the sky is a good idea though. So I think this has too much leftover black in it to do what I need it to do. I just want to clean up the edges here. I used just white for that. I probably should have mixed it with some yellow, but you know. When in doubt, add an airship. <laughs> I wouldn't have even thought about an, like an airplane or something. Okay, I think that looks okay. So friends, I'm gonna need some ideas for our next painting. I do have one more canvas for today. And I would either like to draw the idea out of the hat, or maybe just pick one of the ideas from there, or I kind of wanna try and do like a canvasy kind of or not canvasy oh my god cosmic -y kind of vibe so kind of like my background but like without the stars and stuff like do a nebula what do we think of that ah amy hello how are you today welcome on in happy monday um everything is better with some steampunk i mean why not <laughs> her bussy original starter pokemon as gnomes oh my god I think drawing uh, one out of the hat sounds good. Okay, maybe we should do that. Maybe we'll, how about this? I will draw a few ideas out of the hat and maybe we can do a poll. We can add a gnome to the list though. Uh, cosmic vibe would be pretty. I think so too. I think a cosmic vibe would be really fun. So how about this? We can do a poll. We can do a poll. I just have to figure out how to get to I just have to figure I have to figure out how to get to my keyboard. <laughs> uh, been a stressful day, so glad we got some art going on here, old friend. I'm sorry you've been having a stressful day, but hopefully the chill vibes can make you feel a little bit better. Um, we just drew this idea out of a list of ideas that we did from Friday's stream. So the basic concept was tree, sunset, and swing. Um, so that's kind of kind of the vibe we we have going on. That sounds good. Okay, cool. A gnome, but in space. Wait, add a gnome to whatever drawing is picked. Hold on, hold on. Do you, do you guys want to do a gnome in space? Because if we can just agree to a gnome in space, I am so down to do that. Because I have this canvas here, 
And I think we could do like a gnome in the middle and then do like cosmic shit around. Should we just settle on that idea? What do we think? So that's the second canvas that we're working with today. Or do you still want me to draw ideas out of the hat? Should we still draw some ideas out of the hat too? Gnome in space? Is it gonna be an astronaut gnome or just floating? Ooh. Probably just floating. Probably just a floating gnome. I don't know if I'd want to do an astronaut. I don't think I can do an astronaut. Like, I don't think I'd be able to justify it. You wouldn't be able to tell that it's a gnome as well, maybe? Maybe? Maybe we'll do a poll. It seems it seems like a poll is a good idea. We'll take a little break. Just so that I can go get more water, because I've already drank all my water for today. So give me a sec. I'll get a poll started, and then we'll take a few minute... We'll take a few minute break. All the bookmarks give me that good, good poll. What painting should we do next? Okay, so I'm gonna have Kerbussy, Kerbussy 